begins right now with breaking news. Now at 10, an intense standoff with an armed man inside an Owasso home. Investigators say the man is suicidal and homicidal. Our two works for you anchor Corey Duke has been on the scene all night. Corey, what do investigators know right now and have they evacuated anyone? Well, Brian, both agencies have been here for about five hours now, and yes, they actually have evacuated people from their homes. In fact, a home that is right behind me is being used as the tactical team's headquarters. It all started earlier this afternoon when a wife called police. She said that her husband was depressed and threatening to kill himself, and then when she tried to intervene, she says that her husband then said that he was going to kill her as well. So then the woman was actually able to get out of the house safely, thankfully, and police did respond. The man was still inside. We're told they do have two children, but they are also safe. The man is said to have a weapon and the tactical team has set up a perimeter to just stand outside and to see what they can do to just de-escalate this situation peacefully. Like I said before, it has been nearly five hours and they still have yet to make contact with him. So they said that they're going to stick it out. They're going to stay here throughout the night just to make sure this situation ends peacefully. I'll send it back to you guys.